Just signed to Music for Nations, how did that come about? Well, it was my plan as soon as, uh, as, one, as once I decided to, you know, finish off on the White Lion thing, it was my plan of going back to Europe mentally and uh, sort of almost like physically and start from there and building the band out of there, regardless if we were living in L.A. That's pretty much just for convenience because they live with, uh, you know, their families and this is cheaper that way. But it was always my plan to go with a, with a, a label in Europe and Music for Nation sort of just like sent out a beacon and called me in because they had the, tr the track record for bands like, you know, uh, Metallica, Twisted Sister, Man of War, not, not really that this has anything to do with us musically, but just the effort of wanting to break a band from, from really what it means to break a band instead of just trying to advertise in all the magazines and just a lot of money behind and then try to break a band quickly and the band will die quickly this way. It seems this way, they really go for the, the fans and really every band they break really seem to stay around forever. And that's what I was going for, somebody who really looked for longevity instead of just like a quick success so, you know when does uh, freak of nature's album come out then march 29th in a record store near you okay <laughs> so do you feel that you get a lot more involved with music for nature oh, than definitely you it, it, it's it's phenomenal because it just happens that i was in, in in england at the same time as we're going through all the artwork and approving it and it's just like i'm sitting upstairs and they're coming up and say can you approve this and i look at the lyrics oh that's a mistake you fix that it's almost like you should have in the contract that when you go through the album artwork, you have to be there because it really worked well. You know, it's like, you know, if I'm in America and they're here doing that, you know, that's three days and something get lost in the facts, trust me. So I can honestly say that this album is the perfect album because everything is the way we wanted it. Down to, down to every little grain of paper. It's the way we wanted it. And you couldn't really ask for anything. Well, hey, don't throw any glasses here. You know, it's really what we want. Okay. You know, we've and done the album this way and now we've done the artwork. We follow everything that way. It's phenomenal. Have you noticed as well that the people that actually work there are a lot more into rock than say they were in the big corporate companies? Definitely, I'm out drinking with them tonight. That is probably what I like most about it, is that I can identify with everybody on the record company. It's like I come in and say, oh, where did you get these shoes? I like these shoes. It's like we have something in common. These people actually come into work because they love music, not because, you know, that they just get in a check, which, you know, everybody who works on a major label in America, it's a job. J-O-B, job. Here. I mean, they'll take me out to dinner and drop me off at the hotel, and they'll, they'll go back to work at night at 12 o'clock, and I'm like... Yeah. That's well, just phenomenal. We'll talk to you more in depth uh, when you've got your video for Freak of Nature. Until then, we've got a Rage Against the Machine.